Hello, hey, everybody. everybody. We are live at Bay Studios right now with Vicente Garcia, man. Vicente, thanks for being here. Thank you for receiving us. We are happy to be here to yeah. be singing a couple of songs. Yeah, man, absolutely. We're stoked to have you. Ricardo Munoz, we're stoked to have you as well on the keys, man. And so we're going to do, uh, you guys are going to do three and a half songs today. Yeah. <laughs> uh, two from Alamar, the 2016 album, and one and a half from Candela, which is coming out May 10th. Uh, can you tell us what you're going to do first? Um, we're going to play Amor Pretado. Um, from Alamar, then we are playing Alamar from Alamar. Um, after that, we are doing um, an interlude called Contracanto, and then a song called Lo que más extrañas, uh, again from Candela, my second album, my third album. I'm about to do my third album. So, yeah, we're gonna start. Poca vez en mi pecho he sentido el mundo entero Ver gaviotas que en el cielo van cantando a pleno vuelo Cuántas veces he tenido que llevarme la ilusión Casi siempre me termino conformando el corazón Yo, amor prestado Ay, hombre Amor prestado Ay, hombre Amor del cielo me desploman hasta el suelo sin anhelo y sin consuelo se me agotan los deseos cuántas veces he tenido que llevarme la ilusión casi siempre me termino conformando el corazón yo Amor prestado, ay hombre, amor prestado, ay hombre, amor, amor de náufrago, que se ha quedado sosobrando por la mar. Ay, hombre, amor prestado. Ay, hombre, amor. So now we're playing um, Alamar, the song that gives the title to my second album. Gonna change guitar. It's different tuning. <clears throat> Soy palma que en la brisa 
me baila solo a la mar porque con tu renuncia sé que no puedo contar si llega la cigüita para en mi rama cantar abro mi ventanita con ella salgo a volar vuelan fotografías por mi cabeza y en blanco y negro mi corazón ahogándose, cuestionándome, tú te quiero Tanto que me decía que me quería dulce veneno La confusión quemándome, cuestionándome tu deseo Soy palma que en la brisa le baila solo a la mar Porque de tu regazo sé que no puedo arrimar Si una mariposita viene a mi patio a pasear Juego con su salita, con ella salgo a volar Vuelan fotografías por mi cabeza y en blanco y negro mi corazón ahogándose, cuestionándome, tú te quiero Tanto que me decía que me quería dulce veneno La confusión quemándome, cuestionándome tu deseo Caracoles en la arena, yo te di mi corazón Yo di mi piel pa' tus tambores y de mi boca te di ron Me hice un té con la candela que se enciende con tu amor soy palma que en la brisa le baila solo a la mar Porque con tus amores es que no puedo contar Thank you. All right, thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah, man, it sounds great. And this, are you having as much fun playing this as we are listening to it? In this, yeah, in yeah, new it's kind of tricky because it had a lot of finger... Um, work, but it's yeah, well, nice. I dude, love, I love to sing it. We appreciate you arranging it this way for us here today. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so we just heard two from Alamar, the 2016 album, and we're about to go into uh, to Candela. Um, can you talk a little bit about the the Dominican sounds that you listened to and the uh, the the library that you went into to listen to all the the merengue 78s and uh, the the research that you did in order to inform. Yourself yeah, more than um, I wanted to work with with the merengue for my third album because I I thought it was like a natural evolution uh, from from where I came and in my album Alamar, which was looking into the roots of the Afro Dominican Afro Caribbean um, culture and music and try to bring it back with with popular actual music like pop but trying to grab that um, essence and grab that um, aesthetic um, from the Afro um, singing and way of playing and way of arranging the songs and way of talking like all the culture not just the music and with that in mind I realized I've I've been working with bachata as well in, since my first album, Melodrama, released in 2010. And I thought I haven't uh, worked with, with merengue, which, which is like the most important rhythm from my country, from the Dominican Republic. So um, I wanted to, to work with the merengue, but merengue is like really... Um, it has like really... Um, 
own char characteristic in terms of of uh, the way the 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 um, the number of players like the way it's arranged. Um, it's like really specific, and I really want to to find my sound into this rhythm. So I thought um, that a good idea was to go back into the origins of the merengue. And I went to um, this um, library from the Canal Cuatro in, in Dominican Republic. It's like the state um, station, TV and radio station. So they have a big collection of 78s and singles and, and uh, I started looking to the sound of Joseito Mateo and Diori Valladares because um, they had like a different way of, of work with the harmonies and work with the melodies. And uh, I found there like um, a good example of trying to work with uh, merengue, but instead of playing the tumbao, piano tumbao, change it with a tres or change it uh, with a guitar. And instead of playing merengue with accordion, they did it with the harmonica. Mm -hmm. So in that, that way I could realize how it was like all the lost identities of the merengues. And in, in that, in that material, I found my, my own like way of doing the merengue. Besides that, a lot of great musicians that have done that before, like Juan Luis Guerra, like Luis Diaz, like Wilfrido Vargas, um, that they work with the origins and they mix it with African music and make it make merengue like universal. And that was like a big influence as well. We, what role did uh, did Eduardo Cabra have in that um, in the in his role as as producer on this album? Like what what how what did that relationship look like? I think his role and, began with Alamar with my second album and our first like um, work together. Um, Eduardo um, taught me how to embrace the rhythms and not just be scared about being different in the in in things like the structures in things like changing instruments and replacing it from like instead of doing um sax ha hacks haleo um, do it with an arpeggiator and we worked with that a lot with Trending Tropics with a tro with a project we did after Alamar and before Candela. So I learned how to disrupt like with how to be disruptive with with rhythms and with fusions and and um, of course it it's that's here in in Candela as well. It's part of the result. Um, it's the result of the work that we started with with Alamar, and it goes like a bobbin, and um, all these um, changes like um, of of instrumentation, they were like really um, something that we discussed a lot since Alamar, and we did it a lot with Trending Tropics, and then in Candela we applied it as well. Nice. Well, dude, we're looking forward to hearing what you have to play next, which is probably going to be a very different instrumentation here today yeah, versus what it sounds course. like on the album. I've been playing a lot with with sampling. Again, um, all all my life I've been interested in sampling. Like I remember um, before playing guitar, just recording with a tape cassette in my mom's. Um, Merceria, how do you say it? Like, where they sell like um, zippers and like Merceria. Well, um, where my mom used to work, they had like a cassette recorder. And I remember myself like always recording everybody saying things and then dropping it whenever I wanted. And for me, it was like 
really fun thing to do. And I did it for years. Like, I love doing that. And I think it's something that I just grab it again with the sampling and and just grabbing from the recordings parts and just doing it as a performance. And I really enjoy that. Right, so man. let's try to do it. Yeah. <laughs> This song is called Contracanto and it's a short song from from the album Candela. Como espera la tierra en el campo que caiga la lluvia. Como espera la soa del mango el perfume del sol. Como sopla la brisa después de que pasa el verano. Así espero con calma volver a tener tu querer Como esperan los paros juntos y a contracanto Esa vida que espera en el nido para nacer Como el cielo que espera la nube porque es su manto Así espero con calma volver a tener tu querer Volver con calma Oh no, no, oh no, no, oh no, no Ah, oh no, no, oh no, no, oh no, no Ah, oh no, no no, no. Yeah, yeah. Contracanto. Man, so what do people see when people come out to see you at Terminal? You're playing Terminal Five in yeah, New York playing, on Friday. Uh, you're playing at Paradise Rock Club in Boston on uh, this upcoming Sunday, April 21st. What do people see? What does the arrangement look like on stage? It's really different, but that's what I like. We have like this kind of stuff, but we have a lot of merengue going on, a lot of um, rhythmic, like really um, tropical stuff, and uh, like. It, it has become like um, a really different show since Alamar um, stuff. Now it's really a dance concert. Like people um, dance from the beginning to the end. And, and that's great. That's what I was looking for. I, I wanted to bring not just like songs that people go and sing it, but even if you don't know the songs or you don't know how to speak Spanish, you can enjoy, like, in terms of rhythms, in terms of sounds, you know? So it has a lot of bachata, merengue, son, electronic, um, a lot of Caribbean, like, Haitian, gaga stuff. It has this kind of, to of stuff. Um, and that's it, yeah. I try to bring everything to the stage. Nice. Well, <laughs> hopefully everyone who's watching this right now, this live stream, is able to check you out. Uh, at, at least everyone on the East Coast. It's uh, Terminal 5 on Friday and then Paradise Rock Club in Boston on Sunday. Yeah. And uh, all the details are up at VicenteGarciaMusica.com. That's it. Um, and so you're going to do a fourth and final song. This is also from Candela, right? Yeah. Can it's you tell us what's song, coming up? Uh, it's a mix of bachata and, and reggae and kind of dub elements. And uh, yeah, this is the last song. Thank you. I'm gonna grab this guitar. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite one. It's lovely. I really love it. Por 
Porque hoy se va alejando mi consuelo Se ha derribado el muro y ahora veo tu adiós Soy víctima del desespero y de extrañar los besos que me dio tu boca Suave rozando con mi piel Como el rocío se desliza en el amanecer Amor cuánto te anhelo Eres mi mayor deseo Quisiera ser lo que más extrañas Si es tanto como yo hubiéramos volver Ven que tu adiós me está quemando el alma Ven que tu adiós me confundió la fe Quisiera ser lo que más extrañas Si es tanto como yo hubiéramos volver No hay garantía de que vuelva a conocer el amor Porque en las noches de desvelo Yo comprendí que fuimos algo más que dos Que yo sin tu mirada muero Estar en tu cuerpo siempre me provoca Negra volvernos a querer Cada segundo de esta noche hasta el amanecer Amor cuánto te anhelo Eres mi mayor deseo Quisiera ser lo que más extrañas Si es tanto como yo hubiéramos volver Ven que tu adiós me está quemando el alma Ven que tu adiós me confundió la fe Quisiera ser lo que más extrañas Si es tanto como yo hubiéramos volver No hay garantía de que vuelva a conocer el amor Luego de vivir tu adiós Thank you. Man, that sounded great. Vicente, thank you so much. Ricardo, thank you so much. You that so sounded much. outstanding. And have a great show on Friday at Terminal 5. Have a great show on Sunday at uh, at the Paradise Rock Club in Boston. And best of luck on Candela. It comes out May 10th. Yeah. And uh, thank you for playing uh, one and a half songs from Candela. <laughs> and thank you for playing two from Alamar. It was outstanding, man. Thank you guys so much for coming through and Thanks. doing this. Thanks for having us. All right.